This video is sponsored by Keen. Link is in the description box below and I may receive money from Keen when people use this link. Keen provides access to vetted psychics and spiritual advisors who provide guidance and insight on life challenges, clarity in love, relationships, career, and more. Keen advisors are available 24-7. There's always someone online. You can also easily schedule a call with an advisor. As a new Keen customer, you can try your first 10 minutes for only $1.99. Keen is the most affordable way to meet new advisors. Click on the link trykeen.com slash chelsealove if you are interested to try it out. Hey Satch, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support and I hope all is well with everyone. Today we are going to find out how does your person secretly feel about you right now. This is a general reading and it may not apply to each and every one of you. Okay Satch, let's get a reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me how does Sagittarius person secretly feel about Sagittarius right now. Okay, Sag, please bear in mind that roles can be switched in this reading. Could either be you or the person whom you are thinking about or dealing with because this is not a personal reading, okay? And Sag, I'm not feeling too well still, so I will be going slow in this reading. I hope you don't mind. That may sound a little bit softer or my voice could be a little bit raspy, okay? Um, I've got the Knight of Pentacles here as such. Feels like your person secretly would like to offer you commitment because they feel that they do see a future with you with the Ten of Cups here. For some of you, if you're separated from this person, they would like to reconcile with you. However, if you're currently in a relationship with this person, it also does feel like um, they do see a future with you. Uh, it feels like they would like to commit to you. Uh, Knight of Pentacles is in an Earth sign. Uh, sorry, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Um, it could be dealing with an, uh, an earth sign or it could be Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, can be any sign. Four of Pentacles here is in reverse. Um, it feels like such. Your person secretly feel also that perhaps they are willing to part ways with things from their past or people from their past, okay? Um, or something of value, okay? Could be a home or relocation. I don't know why I'm getting that. That message there that's that's for some of you um, if you are currently in a again a good relationship it feels like this person is again very serious higher uh, fun they would like to take the relationship to the next level and they feel like you are the right person for them they again would like to commit to you if this is someone you have let go of or separated from this person definitely feels that they uh, have learned from their lessons and this time around they want to do right by you, okay? Two of Wands here is in reverse. If your person has another choice or there's somebody else, they secretly feel like you are the right choice. They know 100% that you are the one for them. We've also got the lovers here. It's an upright position, so the lovers could also indicate cho a choice. So it does feel like they secretly feel like they've either made the right choice or that they're choosing you, okay? We've got the eight of wands here as such. So for those of you, if you're separated from this person um, or going through some issues with this person, um, they definitely feel like they would like to talk to you in regards to the future, in regards of a new beginning. Um, I do sense them wanting to have this new beginning with you. However, they feel like with a magician here, that something needs to be done first, okay? Mag the magician indicates somebody whom uh, would like to take actions or would like to make something happen. They secretly feel like they would like to make this happen between the two of you, okay? If you're in a good relationship right now, again, they are very sure that you're the one for them and that they would like to talk to you in regards to being with you long term, okay? Uh, or talking about the future. Let's see more. 
Justice here is in reverse, Ten of Pentacles in reverse, Three of Wands here is in reverse. Again, Sag, if your person has other options, if there is a third party, it does it does feel like um, they secretly would like to let go of the third party or even get a divorce if they were married to this person or still are married to this person, okay? And it feels like with the Six of Cups here in reverse, yeah, there's something about their about their past or past relationships that, that they are willing to part ways with in order to be with you. And see, Six of Cups here is in reverse. It definitely indicates them don't want to return to something or someone from their past and wanting to move and move towards you with the Six of Swords here. For those of you, if you're in a long distance relationship, they secretly feel like they would like to move towards you. Again, they see a future with you and that you're worth it, okay? Strength here is in reverse. This is someone, they secretly also feel like, you know, because <laughs> this can be an egoistic card, but with it, with it being in reverse, they are willing, again, to part ways with part of themselves, whether it, it's their ego or, again, uh, something of value from their past. It could be even money. Again, relocating. I'm, I'm not surprised to see the Six of Swords. Six of Swords can indicate relocation. I know this, this is a little bit, too much of a detail that I don't think everyone is going to resonate resonate but again if you are you know in a long distance relationship with this person or that if both of you could have talked about something about changing uh, or relocating they secretly feel like they would relocate for you okay again if they live somewhere else they would come to see you uh, or that they would like to arrange you to go see them, to be with them long term, not just to see each other for like a short period of time, but this is definitely for long term, okay? Let's see more such. They are very passionate towards you because we've got the King of Wands and the Sun. Yeah, they're very positive, 100% positive that you are the one that they're gonna be happy with for the rest of their life, okay? I don't see the Ten of Pentacles in reverse as this connection with you for some reason. It feels more like a connection they used to have or that currently if they are with somebody else, for those of you, um, if your person is with somebody else, they're willing to let go. Uh, it feels like that connection, they may have been with this person for a long, a long time or that they were married, okay? Or that they still could be married, but definitely thinking about leaving the past person, the person maybe to current person, and then move towards you, okay? Five Swords here is in reverse, yeah? So <laughs> they secretly feel like Again, they would like to give up, give up on things from their past. Something, again, something of value. I know I'm repeating this, but the, the message is really strong, and this is why I'm repeating it. And the sun and the king of wands here, they see it very, very clearly that you are the one that they desire or that they're passionate for, okay? And also, we've got the nine of cups here in reverse. Let's just see a little bit more. Yeah, they're, they're willing to offer you commitment again. So for some of you, maybe both of you have either different background or both of you not living in the same place or that different in age, age gap, or difference in success level or um, your money, the money in the bank. That's what, what I'm hearing, money in the bank. Maybe different one. One person may be more like well to do than the other okay so we've got the king of swords here in reverse nine of cups in reverse mm. it's like they're willing to let go again if this this could indicate somebody if it's an upright position wanting to have their cake and eat it too especially if they have other options they don't want it they don't want it they're willing to be selfless for you okay perhaps in the past they may have been a little bit selfish and also with the King of Swords here in reverse, it feels like they're not telling you this, but they are going to, okay? This could be them quietly strategizing to move towards you. And temperance here is in reverse. <laughs> Every time when they think about you, they feel very emotionally, um, like, 
out of whack like out of balance kind of like make my knees weak kind of an energy that i'm getting here i don't know why this reading i'm just reading it in a very different perspective perhaps this is the message that uh, spirit wants you to hear okay such this is your reading i hope you resonated if you did please hit like share and subscribe and i'll leave you with a video on the screen right now this is the video from my second blog channel if you're interested to check it out and also i'm open for personal oh, i'm not open for personal reading you see my head is not <laughs> my head is not straight because i'm not feeling well but anyway i was gonna say that i post your videos almost every single day however at different timing if you like to be notified every time when i post your videos don't forget to hit on the bell notification button all right take care Satch. bye